me Audra and welcome back to my channel for those of you that are new I'm not sure how you got here but certainly I'm glad you came all right so it's finally time stitch fix is here guys uh, so last time I actually decided to keep nothing uh, one of the things I'm trying to look at is if I have something that I'm sort of tepid on where I'm just like mm, should I maybe mm, I'm just not gonna keep it because like it's just gonna sit in my closet look how crazy my hair is right now What's up? All right, so anyway, uh, I just decided that if I don't have like an immediate feeling for it, and then I also go look in my closet and see if there's anything similar, or if there's something that I like, but like I don't love, but like, is there any way to match this up and make it a part of my wardrobe, or is it just like another weird standalone piece that goes with nothing until I find something to go with it? All right, so let's go ahead and get started with this box. Also, just FYI, it is um, weird, I guess it's fall? in Texas. I guess it's fall. And so I don't have the air conditioning on and the windows open. So if you hear like outside noise, that's what it is. Also, it's bow chewing on whatever toy he's got. All right. So as you guys may have seen from the thumbnail, this is a bit of a thicker box. So I think like either shoes or a bag have to be in here. I actually did not check online. And are you guys feeling my no makeup makeup look? Does it look like I naturally look like this? All right. Okay, so anybody who doesn't know, Stitch Fix is, is a clothing subscription box. It's $20. Uh, and then if you buy anything, the $20 goes towards the purchase. If you choose not to buy something, you just lose the $20. It's a gamble. No. <laughs> You can also, I don't know if it's available to everyone yet, um, it should be at this point, like it would be ridiculous if it wasn't because it's been over a year, but um, you also have the Style Pass which you pay $49 and you just get unlimited fixes as often as you want, and from there, I like that one, sometimes, we'll talk about that some other time. Alright, so I have the little card here, you get an envelope to send things back, you also have a price list, which I am not going to look at at the front end, we'll be looking at that later, and I was correct, shoes or a bag, I said, so let's see, oh no, oh my god, you guys, I kind of dig it. I kind of dig it. <laughs> Squeeze. Oh, Lord. Okay. That's going to be a whole other. Oh, gosh. I really like those. I hope that they're not stupid expensive because I really like them. This is my bundle here. I have updated my style preferences. I took Boho completely out because uh, I, I don't know. I'm just over that right now. Maybe that's my summer style, but it's not really my winter style. And I'm also wanting things to be fitted. I'm kind of getting over, like, everything being so flowy. Um, I think when I originally started that, it was more hiding my bony frame. But I have reached a point where I'm over it, and I'm just like, I got bird shoulders. I'm going to deal with that. And I, I don't mind showing it off now. One, two... Three. Such a good boy. All right. So I have these. They might be too big, but we will see. They look cute, but they look like they're going to stop at the ankle. And I don't like it when they do that. It's cold. Well, I don't know. It just depends. It just depends. In the winter, I don't mind, but in the summer, like I'm, it's, it, I'm backwards. All right. Next up, we have some kind of Betty Boop contraption here. I was right. <laughs> A pretty dress. Oh, Lord. My other kryptonite, guys. Plaid. And it's really soft. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. All right, and then we have a, oh my god, this is soft too. Like, why does it all this, what is this made out of? All right, and then we have this, which it has like a, one of them floppy necks, so we'll see how this all, oh goodness, oh. All right, so we're going to see how everything looks, and we're probably going to start with the dress. And I think I might try everything on on the balcony and see how that works out. Let's just check it out. It's nice. It's beautiful. It's really hot right now. But let's move on. trying everything on I am ready to let you know what's going back in the bag so <laughs> let us get started that dress you guys first of all it is certainly not cute enough to be hundred and eighteen dollars I uh, no absolutely not I'm basically just pay paying for the name Ralph Lauren and um, I'm not gonna do that because I could find a dress like this on Amazon, pretty much guaranteed, just as cute, cheaper, significantly cheaper. So that's going back in the bag immediately. All right. So then the next thing I actually want to talk about are these jeans. I love these. Funny story, though. Um, one, I actually have a jacket from Just USA, I'm pretty sure, in this color. In fact, let's check. Actually, it's the Kenzie jacket. I bought Kenzie instead of the Just USA one. Let's see. Smart. However, it's very matchy-matchy, and I always have a love-hate relationship with these kinds of jeans because the thing is, I know 
the second I wash these, like you see it's kind of, it's already got a little bit of a fade, but it's still a beautiful, brilliant color, right? But I know the moment I wash these, the color is just going to go right out of them. Like it's just, it's going to be a sad affair. And it starts, like the first time you wash it, it's like, it's kind of sad. By the second or third, you're just really depressed and you're like, Mwah. And for me to spend, what are they wanting for those? Now, for me to spend $58 on these for them to fade, I'm not willing to do it. So these are going to go back in the bag. Now, the shoes by report. These are mine. I just wanted you to know. <laughs> I'm not even asking, like, should I keep? No, these are mine. I just, these, these belong to me. These are my shoes. Uh, they're freaky cute. Uh, I love them. Although you're definitely, I'm definitely going to say this, you need to have like a little slide sock on because these will end up smelling like the worst kind of feet known to man. But I just love them. There's something, I don't know, so fun. And it's like, ugh. And so like stylish. And they're kind of on trend. Like this, this, uh, yeah. Don't judge me too harshly. All right, so obviously those aren't going back in the bag. Uh, this sweater is going back in the bag. Number one, okay. First, I don't like this. I don't like these necks, okay? I don't because I have a tiny, tiny neck and a big head. And when you have a tiny neck and a big head, and then you get this, it only emphasizes how freaking big my head is. Look at this. It's like boop, boop, boop. I'm like a little bobblehead. So I would prefer not to have that. The other thing is, I don't know who thought that we were like all fancy librarians with this on the back, but I'm just done with it. It doesn't even line up properly. When I put this this sweater on, I actually had to do a little bit of work to get that to line up so that I could show it to you guys in the try-on. And that's just like, I'm no. So I look at that and I'm just like, why am I gonna pay $68 for my library sweater? Like, get out of here. So that's a no. That's going up back in the bag. All right, so the last thing is, okay, so the reason I love this, I absolutely love this, but the reason it's going back in the bag is because for the price of just this one, I could get almost three of these from Nadine West, almost three. Not this brand, but it's the same softness, it's, this, it's really good quality, and each one of those is probably 20 some odd dollars, so I'm just not about to spend $64 for one shirt, but I will for these shoes. You know what I wish they had? It's just like a shoe fix. Not just fab, not shoe dazzle, but a shoe fix. Do you see what I'm saying? Where every month they send, like, or however many, two times a week, whatever. But they send you shoes, because that's what I need. They send you shoes to try on, and you try the shoes on, and then you're like, yo. And then once you like the shoes, then I was going somewhere with this. Then you keep them. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Um... I get a little cuckoo uh, when it's hot. Like I wanted, so I turn the air conditioning off. And anyways, back to this story. I'll tell you about the air conditioning in a minute. So the total for this was two sixty-seven seventy-five. Coming up next is going to be a battle between the Stitch Fix and the Nadine West because I've kind of been showing you guys the price differences and how much you get for each one, and talking about quality and all that kind of stuff. So right now, all I'm keeping out of this are the shoes. These one, the shoes are bomb. The shoes are boss. I can wear them a lot. I have a lot of functionality that I can get out of that pair of shoes. I can wear it with a dress if I want to. I can wear it with jeans. I can wear it with shorts. It, it's got a lot of versatility. So I, I'm down with those shoes and I really like the Report brand. I have a pair of booties by them and I love them and I still wear them. So I just, I think that this bag, it, it was a good fix in that like a lot of my style preferences were nailed, right? Like a lot of my style preferences were nailed. I love colored jeans, but I'm really kind of particular about which ones I get. And there was something that I could tell about that, that color that I could feel that when I, I don't, it's a feeling I get, like I can look at it and know that if I wash it, it's going to fade. And there are ones where I can look at it and be like, hmm, the fading's going to be minimal. There was just something where I could look at that and I was like, hmm, the fading's going to be pretty rough. Uh, and then, you know, they, they really hit it up, like with the plaid shirt, they knew, they got that. I love plaid. Like, I, that's probably all I'm going to wear all winter is just like plaid everything. Um, so prepare yourselves for that. Uh, and then, you know, but it's just, 
man. The prices. Guys, these prices. And again, I'm not a person who's sitting here saying, like, I am not willing to pay for quality. But what I'm going to say is if I can get the same quality elsewhere, then I'm, and it's cheaper than I'm going to. The other thing, too, is that dress is nothing special. It's, it's, a, it's a Ralph Lauren dress, right? But it's not special. And so at this point, I'm just literally paying to have a Ralph Lauren dress. $118 for a dress that does nothing. It says it's not special. It's doing, it didn't even do anything extra fantastic for my figure, as far as I'm aware. So you guys let me know in the comments what you think about my fix. And we have a battle coming up, and then I also have a five things video coming up. So one of the things I'm going to start doing for um, the channel is five things. And uh, it's, it sounds weird, but it's uh, five things, and every time I'm just going to have five things that uh, irritate me, make me happy, ranty things, whatever, but it'll just be like a series of five things. So I have a lot of beauty video videos up right now. Uh, if you haven't gotten to check them out, please do. Um, one of the reasons is I'm doing a little bit of fun stuff with fashion. I'm trying to get more into my fashion, which I've been doing for a long time, but I always just kind of like backed out of it because I felt like I was doing being stupid. But now I'm just going to do it. So we're, we're going to have fun. I got a lot of love on my how to wear, a rock, how to rock a graphic tee. So we're going to keep going in that direction. I am still going to do some of the beauty unboxings. And um, my main boxes are boxes that I find. Like I'm just going to find new boxes. I don't know why my hands became crabs but boxes that I find and also one of my favorite things is quarterly subscriptions I think one of the reasons I like to do those is because it is a significant amount of money that you're gonna part with so I thought it'd be cool if I checked those out so anyways so that leads me into my next thing if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you have not already please consider subscribing now is the time y'all cuz I'm about to get heavy into this I work 12 hours a day every day and yet I come here to hang out with y'all. Actually, I love that. I hang out with you guys because I do work 12 hours a day. It's hard to have friends and do stuff with people when you're always at work. So it's just like me and Bo. And now it's you guys. Thanks. All right, guys. Thank you so much. I love each and every one of you. And until next time. Do this. Do this. I'm getting dumber with every second here. What is that? Back to myself, but don't have a clue. I'm looking for someone. I can't find a door that's <laughs> open.